के नाम पर डियर लिसनर्स वेलकम टू माय क्लास आई एम मोहम्मद हबीबुल मौला असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इंग्लिश टुडे आई विल डिस्कस विथ यू अबाउट द चेंज ऑफ स्पीच एंड बिफोर स्टार्टिंग आवर डिस्कशन वी विल एंजॉय सम ऑफ द इमेजेस लुक एट द पिक्चर एन एलिफेंट इज प्लेइंग विथ अ फुटबॉल एंड देयर इज अ मैन हु इज टेकिंग केयर ऑफ द एलिफेंट व्हाट ही से he said kick the ball mark the sentence he said kick the ball here he is the speaker said is the reporting verb within the inverted comma the reported speech is given here it is in imperative form then what will be the change the change will be in this way he ordered instead of said we will have to add ordered to kick the ball in every change you will have to add two before the principal verb of the reported speech that is uh, within the uh, inverted comma you will have to find out the verb at first and you will have to add two before it if it is imperative in sense and but if it is in negative sense then you will have to add not to look at the sentence at first follow the image uh, one cat is disturbing another one one said to another don't disturb me it's a negative form it's a negative impression one requested another not to disturb him what's the change here one said to another that is one one cat requesting another not to disturb him here we have got don't it is in negative sense so we will have to add extra not to before the root form of the verb root form of the verb instead of don't and as usual you will have to add him instead of me look at the picture there are some penguins and they are on snow slides they are playing and enjoying themselves look at the picture and mark the sentence the penguin said let's jump into the sea it's a proposal the penguin proposed to other penguins let's jump into the sea and they are following him the picture shows it the penguin proposed that what is the change mark the sentence the penguin said that is the penguin proposed that they should jump into the sea the penguin proposed instead of said you will have to add proposed and instead of let's we will have to add they should and this is the change and we have no need to change anything here so what should be the topic today indirect and direct speech of imperative sentence and how we will we will convert the sentence what are the rules here follow it what is imperative sentence follow the images march on the commander is commanding his he said to his followers march on the penguin proposed to one another let's go the boy said get out or as i speak the truth someone said an imperative an imperative sentence and it's a universal truth or as i speak the truth and the girl is uh, requesting to take it take the glass of milk here imperative sentence we mean order request advice and command then how it is formed do it at once follow the sentence at first you will get the base form of the verb and what will be the structure verb plus object plus extension this is pattern 1 and this is pattern 2 let me do this it will start with let let plus object plus verb plus extension this is pattern 2 then how reporting verb changes in pattern 1 follow it if you get said to then you will have to change ordered plus object plus 2 plus reported space if you get command then you will have to change said to and you will have to use commanded subject plus two plus reported speech if you get some request then you will have to change said to and you will have to add requested and if you get some suggestion or advices then you will have to change said to 
and you will have to add advised plus object plus two plus reported space. This is the structure. Follow the sentence. He said to me, do your duty. It's very easy to you. He said to me, that is, he ordered me to do my duty. Follow the answer. He ordered me to do my duty. In this way, you will have to change. Here is a commander and some of the followers here. The commander said to the soldiers, march on. What you will have to do? You will have to change it in this way. The commander commanded to march on. March is verb here. And you will have to change in this way. Then you will get some one sentence. That is, here is a man who is uh, saying something. He said to me, please help me. He is requesting. He requested me to help him. Here you will get uh, the change. That is, if you get please, then you will have to add requested. Then you will have to add to instead of the uh, in front of the principal verb of the sentence. He said to me, obey your parents. Then the answer will be, he advised me to obey my parents. This is the change here. How reporting verb changes in pattern 2? He said to me, let me drop the matter. What will be the change? You will have to begin with let. Let me drop the matter. Then you will have to change requested plus object plus that plus subject plus might plus verb on plus extension. Then the answer will be he requested me that he might drop the matter. You will have to add extra might here uh, instead of let. He said to me, let us play the match. It's a proposal. Then the answer will be he proposed to me that we should play the match. We should play the match. Some of the sentences are given here to change. He said to me, let him go. My friend said to me, let us settle the dispute. The teacher said to the student, follow elders. Rohim said, let us swim in the pond. So, let us swim in the pond. The man said to the boys, let him enjoy the game. These are the home tasks for you. You will have to change the sentences. Don't forget. He said to me, don't disobey your parents. He advised me not to disobey my parents. In this way, you have to change it. Mother said, don't follow the bed. Mother advised not to follow the bed. Then the notes, you will have to remember, if the reported speech begins with imperative don't, you have to write not to before reported speech. I have already said it at the beginning of my speech while changing a direct speech into indirect speech. Then write the structure, pair works, you will have to form pairs with your friend and you will have to write the structure of imperative sentence pattern 1 and how the reporting verb changes and you will have to write down two more examples. Uh, for your clear conception. Write the structure of imperative sentence pattern 2, group 2 and 4 and then you will have to write down more two examples to uh, make your understanding clear. Your home task is again given here. The teacher said to me never tell a lie. In this way we can write down the answer. The teacher ordered or told never to tell a lie. The teacher forbade to tell a lie. You will have to uh, change in this way. Mother said to his sons, go to the go to his school regularly. Father said to his son, that is, father told his son, father ordered his son, father suggested his son, father advised his son to go to his school regularly. He said to me, please give me a hundred taka. He, he requested me to give him a hundred taka. Get out, he said. He ordered to get out. He told to get out. Let's enjoy the match. Someone proposed that they should enjoy the match, or, or he said, or he proposed that they should enjoy the match. In this way, we will have to change the sentences. Dear listeners, I think you have already understood what I have said and I like to finish here and in my next class, I will discuss with you about change of interrogative sentence. Thank you very much.